guys, welcome back to Winthrop Hostess. Today's hoster is the Government Model 1911 inside the waistband holster. It's a little tight. We do make it kind of, kind of tight so it fits the gun like a glove. And here is your 1911. This version has no rail to it. This is your standard 1911, full size, and you're inside the waistband holster. So we'll insert the cast mold back into the holster. Like I said, it's very tight. It's dual snaps, which we'll demonstrate in part two of the video. You actually feed the snaps around the belt and over the belt. Also a reinforced mouth that keeps the mouth open for the whole string. I'll turn the hole so you'll see the shield on the back, which is very important. This is the body shield. The body shield actually keeps the gun from rubbing against you. And also you can see we have a curve, which is called a combat cut, which keeps the gun from rubbing against you. The shield does, and also the grip. Gives you a good grip without having to have the shield against your hand when you have to take the gun out. So, custom molded. Fits like a glove. It's your 1911. Part two, we will show how it looks when you wear a 1911 with the inside the waistband holster. Stay tuned for the second part. Well, guys, welcome back to part two of the 1911, the government model. This is the black holster, the inside the waistband holster. As you can see, the gun it pulls nice and tight against the body. The dual snaps are around the belt, and also they go behind and over the belt. We'll just go here and snap that back on. And you have your, your reinforced mouth, which is right here, and the shield is hidden in the back. So as you can see, this is being worn at about a 330 position. And Scott, if you can turn towards me, and you can see it's pretty much hidden. That 330 position is what I would be really go for because of the concealment. Now again, this is a full-size 1911. As you can see, it's hidden on the inside the waistband. And then Scott, you can put your hand on it to see how, what kind of grip you can get. The grip is perfect. You can get a nice grip and you can actually draw the gun very easily if you have to. So, as you can see, this is the 1911. And again, the snap here. Our snaps are very, very tight. So, as you can see, you just have to give it a little work in. And it's very comfortable as well, too. And again, take note that this is the full size 1911. Thank you for watching part two. And again, before I go, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you can produce more videos and you'll get more content. Thank you.